Roll call. You know, Volpe had the loudest reaction out of anybody when they went around, so. Looking for a big day from him today. Schmidt's been working on this cutter all off season. Look at it move right there. It's effective on both sides of the plate. And he gets the wave and the miss right there. One away now for the Yanks. Double play and their inning's over. So we'll see if they can get the throttle to ground out here. Good heads up base running here. Guy goes for the bunt, misses. Estrada goes for the bunt, misses. Here's the throw down to first. He's like, I'm already off. I might as well go. And Rizzo doesn't know this. So he's going to tag the ghost runner. There's nobody there. And Wade Jr. takes second base easily. So there goes that double play. I think they're going to be unlucky. They're going to get the out regardless. Two away now. But the runner does go to third. So crazy sequence there. But the Giants got the leading run 90 feet away. Now. There's Cobb. I think he's a little bit of help from the umpire here. Well, maybe he's got a pretty good eye. He doesn't agree with it at all. And oh, yeah. He got a generous call there on Mayhew. He knows. He said, hey, cuz, you missed that one. And now you got to answer to the judge. Holy shit. Good job by Aaron Judge working the count here. Ball is down, but he doesn't care. He's going with it. Drops that barrel. Puts it in between the 5-6 hole, and that's going to go through for a base hit. Excellent job by Judge. Worked the count. Got the 3-1. Fouled off a couple pitches, and then gets rewarded with a single. See if the Yankees can add on. Oh, batter's got to be set and looking at you. Right there, Cobb set too early. Now the umpire has a little discussion and says, hey, you got to let him get set. We're going to see some of that early this year. And I'm sure we'll see it at certain points throughout the campaign as well. But, uh, you know, Rizzo works it to a full count now. Payoff pitch coming up. Oh, come back into the mound. All right, boys, let's turn two. Let's get out of the... Oh, shit, there it goes. There it goes. In the center field. So he has plenty of time, sets his feet, and oh, yep, there's that bad arm angle. He knew right away. Yep, there that thing goes. Yep, that's not where you want it. And instead of getting the double play to end the inning now, a run comes home, and you got another runner in scoring position. Oh, jeez, man, that's got to be a bad feeling for Cobb. Good thing this double play ball is still in effect. Just hope it's not hit to you next time. That's all you got to hope for. That makes Hit the Brandon Crawford. That guy's got a good glove. He knows what he's doing. What the hell's going on here? I mean, that's not even that's not Gabe Kapler either, is it? See, that's the pitching coach. So what the hell's he doing out there? I don't know. Whatever. One away here for the Giants. Now they're trailing. Cobb gets robbed here. That was the same place as strike two. Definitely caught enough of the plate. And Cobb cannot catch a break right now. And JD keeps fouling him off here, so. Look at that, 30 pitches already. Yeah, the total is 14 to 16, so that ratio is not the best either. Less than stellar first inning for Mr. Cobb here. See if he can get it together in time. Here's the pitch. Does get the strikeout on JD, gets the outer half of the plate. It's a little bit of redemption there. It was a strike, too. It wasn't like he got any help on that one. That was definitely strike three. So he's motoring along right now. See if he can get out of this inning without any more damage. Here's the off speed. Close call there for Glaber. Thought he offered it first. Guess not. Counts even at twos. Schmidt kind of gets away with one here. He hung this curveball. Luckily, it broke enough. And it fooled old Brandon Crawford. He gets him to wave and miss at it. Now there's two away here. Four strikeouts already for Schmidt through two innings. Guy keeps chugging along. Let's see if he can get out. Welcome to the show, Sable. Three-one pitch. He decides to lay a bunt down. That's a bold strategy in and of itself, but it works. Look how far back Josh Donaldson was there. How far he had to come get it. And Sable looks like he's quick. He gets down the line with no problem, and he gets a bunt single for his first MLB hit. Congrats, Blake. Way to go. There you go, man. Nice job. Yeah. Great heads up play there. He noticed, hey, defense is back. I got a little bit of room here if I want to try something. And he gets it. Good job, man. I'm slightly impressed. I must admit. Now you got a runner in scoring position here with two outs. See if the Giants can knock things up here. Come on now, Roberto. 
Oh shit, he played for the Bucks. That's right, I forgot about him. Hey, look at this paint right here. <laughs> right on the corner. Beautiful. And that wasn't even a strike. He got robbed right there. See if he can get him on this pitch. Barely, but they get him. Welcome to the show, Volpe. Breaking ball, but he goes down with. Look at that. He's, he's, look at the back knee right here. Damn near touched the dirt. Just out of the reach of Brandon Crawford. And into left field for your first major league hit. Everyone's been seeing this guy's praises. They're saying he's the next Jeter. That's a lot to live up to. But old Volpe's done it, man. He's finally here. And he's going to get the crew to mark the ball up for him. Good for him, man. Well, in case you show. also didn't know, uh, the kid has wheels too. Not even a throw from Perez back behind the plate. Yeah, that, guy, that kid can scoot. I wish I could have ran like that back in my day. He stole on opening day, I'm pretty sure. So that's the second one in the career, but man. Like I said, kid's got wheels. There may be some hope for him after all here. In New York. Not only can he hit, the glove's not too shabby either. Yeah, back-to-back -back MVPs incoming. Only a matter of time. Giancarlo Stan hits it over that little league fence in right field. And gets the Yankees on the board, or extends the lead, I should say, 2 nothing. Hit it hard. It didn't have to go very far, but again, gets the job done. Take a look at it. Ball in the outer half. My gosh. Uh, imagine how far the ball would go if this guy just used his lower half. Seriously. He hit balls 500 feet, like regularly. <laughs> it's ridiculous, man. Freaking nature. And the damage has been done. Just like that, yanks up 2 nothing. Jock Pierce says, I can do that too. Want to have that short porch out there in right field? Fine, I'll hit one there too. So, hey, he had it was an all-star campaign last year for him. He hit that one further than Giancarlo hit his. Holy shit. Let's take a look at this pitch right here. Yeah, that ball's down, but it's the swing we see all the time. Just drops that barrel. And gets enough of it. There it goes. <laughs> he loves it. Hell yeah, Jock. Get pumped up one time, young man. Just like that, the lead's been cut in half. Oh, he's talking his shit in there. I love it. That's good. We got a tilt here in the Bronx. Fucking right. Let's have some fun. Here's Yastrzemski now. It's a pitch he can handle easily. Tucks it inside the line. He puts the Jets on, head down. Oh, yeah, he was there by a mile. No chance for Volpe to make the tag on that play. And look out. Giants are putting together a little bit of an inning here. Nobody down, and you already got the tie and run and scoring position here. See if the Giants can make some magic out. Oh, yeah. The Giants aren't fucking around right now. Brandon Crawford. Struck out on his first at bat. He was not going down again. He crushes this one off of Schmidt. Man, oh, days. That was high as hell. Watch this pitch right here. Yep, elevated pitch. Your dick's got to get hard when you see that one, and Brandon Crawford knew. As soon as that thing left the bat, yeah, that bad boy's gone. See you later. Upper deck right there. And Schmidt's like, oh, fuck me. God damn it. Giants love that, though. You already know it, Dan. That'll do it for Schmidt. Walk of shame, baby. We got a game now. 3-2 Giants. Ralta comes into the game. First pitcher he faces. Oh, yep. Take a listen. Ouch. Yeah, that hit him square. Tough break there for the kid. Hey, guess what? No pain without no gain. Now you got to run around with one out. See if the Giants can get some more offense. Close call here on the double play. Perez does beat the throw there before Rizzo closes the glove. So that was the right call. Nonetheless, two outs here. So still some life for the Giants. Now they're back to the top of the order too. So 
See if they can make something happen. Sweet swinging from Jock Pearson and Crawford. And this is where we stand. Here's Cabrera. Ball's breaking away from him, but he gets enough contact. Gets it out of the reach of the second baseman. And that's going to be a base hit. Yankees not going away yet either. Only down by one here. They're going to see if Trevino can get him back in. Ooh, good pitch to look at right there. What are we doing? Close call here. Cabrera, ooh, he was close. He almost got picked there. Just snuck that right hand around the tag. Volpe with a daddy hack there. Eyes behind 0-2. See if Junis can get something to get him out here. Close call here for Volpe. Might want to get rid of it a little quicker next time, cuz. That was really close. Watch this. Hard 90s. We always talk about it. Man, if he doesn't look over some any time, maybe he gets it, but man, that was a very close play. Luckily, a break here for Yastrzemski. Right away, you can tell he doesn't, he, the sun's fucking with him. He's like, oh shit, that ball's going over my head. That's a, that's a helpless feeling right there, and LeMayhew represents the uh, tying run on second base. <laughs> well, this isn't the guy you want up in that situation, that's for sure. Literally the next pitch. Ball stays inside and Aaron Judge those hands in. On the breaking ball, base hit. Mayhew doesn't score on it, but either way, two on and nobody out. And you got two, three, four due up here for the Yankees. It's not going to get much easier. Junis is in one right now. Bats are alive and well in the Bronx here. Anthony Rizzo goes down on the breaking ball. Hits it past the right fielder, goes all the way to the wall. Two runners in scoring position now, still nobody out, and now we have a tie game, and John Carlos up. Boy, this could get ugly real quick for the Giants. Not a hard hit ball by John Carlo. An easy field here for the Giants. They're gonna get that one away. So now you got one away now. So you got a little bit of life, defensively at least. But again, this inning is still far from over. Now you got J.D. up. He's oh, great. so close to the Yankees breaking this one open, but right there. Ooh. Just to the left of the chalk. Yep, not enough. And now J.D.'s in the hole, 0-2. See if Junis can make something happen here. Close. <laughs> no love for JD here. Yes, sir. That is uh, no. That's that's on the chalk of the other batter's box. Yeah. As much as I hate JD, he's got a case there. He's uh, that's that was not even close to being able to be hit. You need a shovel to hit that one. Yanks are in trouble now. Two on, two out, and oh, that'll kill the inning right there. So they're able to tie things up, but man, missed opportunity there. We got a brand new game all over Crawford. again. Nice pitch there, and he still gets a hold of it. Gets it out of the outreached arm of Giancarlo. And here come the Giants all the way around. Hit the bricks real quick. You're not scoring on that. Now you got two on with nobody out. Giants aren't going. This isn't good. Right here. Ouch. Sable gets hit for the second time today, and they're stalling right now. I think they're trying to get an arm up because this guy's done. Bases loaded. No Great breaking ball there. Ugly swing from Perez. Sword! See you later, pal. So that was supposed to be one and two, and now you're heading back to the dugout. Disgusting. Double play can end the inning here. There it is. It's off the knob here, and somebody's got to have this ball. Good heads up base Ryan. Nobody covers home. Yep, that's a freebie. And everybody's safe. And the inning continues. Holy Ken gets a little bit of help here. That ball misses high. But it gets called strike three nonetheless. Oh, man, that's bad. Well, he's been inconsistent both ways, though. Consistently inconsistent. And oh, geez, Volpe. Not the recovery in time. Uh-oh. 
Oh, jeez. <laughs> they can't exactly. They can't hit the ball outside of the dirt here, and they're still able to get runs across. Aaron Boone doesn't like it, you know. King probably doesn't like it. Here it is. Hard hit ball. He's going the wrong way. He shades away from the ball. And then as he tries to dive back, he can only knock it down. And isn't able to get the out at second. Tough break there for the kid. Bases remain loaded with two outs. Now you got Jock up. Floodgates gates could open. Play by here. Lamont Wade here. Look at all the first baseman. Watch this. Diving stop. Quick up to his feet. Nice pitch there. Right to his pitcher, Junis. One away here for the Giants. Electric start to this ball. There's another borderline call. That is the top of the zone, but I can see that one going either way. And Obviously, the Strimski does not think uh, that it should have been a strike. And he's taking the walk of shame back. JD had a rough day at the plate today. Until now. Tucks that one inside the foul pole. And now it's a one-run game. Oh, baby. It's getting good. Here's Rogers. Kept those hands back on the off-speed pitch. Bang. See you later. That was well inside the foul pole, I should say. Three souvenir for somebody in the upper deck. Don't look now. Yankees making a little comeback. Jack Peterson having a great day at the plate. Follows this breaking ball from Clay Holmes all the way down. Drops that barrel. Line drive over the head of the second baseman. Such a great hitter, man. Now you got one on, one out. See if they can try and get one more run across. Get a little bit more cushion for this bottom of the ninth. Come Giants are not afraid to swing on 3-0. And right there you see it. Nostremski drills it into the gap in right center. And let's watch Jock Peterson run. Turn on the Jets, big fella. He's not stopping at third. He's coming all the way around. Yes, sir. Get that oxygen tank out when you get to the dugout. Great hit there by Yastrzemski. Perfect opportunity to make something happen. And now the Giants have a two-run lead again. And they still got a guy in scoring position here. So don't stop. JD here, nice little backhand. Look the guy back. Fired across the diamond. No problem there for Rizzo. That's textbook right there. Old JD. Not a bad day so far. See if Crawford can extend the inning. Great the play for Brandon Crawford continues. Breaking ball away. He goes with it. Right off the end of the bat there. Over the head of the third baseman and into left field. That's an RBI single. And that just might be the dagger for the Giants. Yastrzemski hard around the bag. No problem scoring there. And walk of shame for Clay Holmes. See you, Pat. Great time to steal by by Brandon Crawford. Reliever just came into the game, so he's probably not worrying about the base runner. And Brandon Crawford puts the head down and swipes second base easily. And now you got another runner in scoring position. No force play here either. See if old Cody Johnson can make something. Yeah. A rough night for the guy on the behind home plate tonight. This is called a strike. Now Aaron Hicks has to protect here. Three two. Close call there. This is called on the swing, I believe. It does catch the bottom of the zone. Let's take a look here at Hicks's offer. Oh yeah, that. Uh, I think that was. I think it was a strike, regardless. But I think he offered there. One away here for Doval. Here's Volpe. Second hit of the day. Yeah, that pitch is right down the middle. He drives it right back up the middle. Nice smooth swing there. And the Yankees have some life here. Top of the order up now. This could get Judge continues to swing the hot stick. Pitch right down the middle. Puts it between that 5-6 hole and the way Volpe runs. No question he's scoring on that one. Two-run game. The captain's getting his team pumped up. Says, come on, boys. We're not out of this yet. 
Tying run now on the, on the bases. Winning runs at home with Anthony Rizzo. Gotta love this right now if you're a Yankee fan. There's another one. <laughs> that is not a strike, sir. It just isn't. That ball is inside. Rizzo had to slide out of the way. My gosh, how can you call that? I'm not even a Yankee fan, I'm, and I'm livid with this. Like, you can't make these calls. And if they had called out on a strike, that place would have erupted. Another look at it. Yeah, good hold. Good hold by Rizzo. Good veteran here. All right, 2-1 count. Not entirely ahead, but you are in control. Ooh, got him on the change there. Good pitch by Doval. Yeah, that one just fell right off the table. Bend the knee, Rizzo. 2-2, two, two. what are you throwing here? You go back to that change up again? I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking high heat here. Let me get him to chase the high heat. Let's take a look here. Giancarlo pounds this one into the ground. Crawford goes six. There's four. Looks like did it. And there's three. Are they going to review the guy at second base? Because I think Peterson... Mm, did he have control, though? He kept his foot on the bag, I think, but did he have control before he wiped out? Hey, no one's walking away just yet. This game might not be done. It's got to be indisputable. Let's take another look. Does he have complete control? The ball's right there. And then it slides into the glove. Now is it cons now is it under control already? Is it already under control here? I to me yes. As a first baseman, yes. That's he has control of the ball and his foot was on the bag. To me, that's an out. And now what about Estrada here? Is that foot on? I don't know. I think it might have came off. That's really close. They have another angle of it. I couldn't really tell. That one was that one was tougher to see than the first base one. That one, I think you could make a case that maybe his foot did come off. I don't. Here's another look at it. And that's all she wrote. Double play is turned. And the Giants escape the Bronx with a win. Oh, a thriller till the end. Say, so, Yankees had plenty of chance to put this game away. Just couldn't do it. Not enough guys stepped up when they needed to. That's your game.